Uh, hello out there YouTube, welcome back to my channel, Pollock's World of Entertainment. Um, thanks for tuning in. Uh, my video today, I am doing a tour of a park that I grew up in. It is Scott Township Park. It, it is in, actually also part, Scott Township is also a part of Carnegie. And it is right in between Heidelberg and Mount Lebanon. And, um... Yep, so for the tour, I'm going to be showing you, you I'm going to be, actually have the camera on me for, uh, for the most part, because again, I don't, I don't want to put anybody actually on YouTube who doesn't want to be there, so I'm just going to be showing, showing views from a distance, and um, from there, we're, we're basically going to be walking through. So here is the bottom part of the park. And the, the park has been around for a very long time, actually, I believe going back to the 60s. Um, the pole was newly remodeled a, uh, about three years ago now, or the three or three, yeah, three or four, uh, three or four years ago. I've been four years ago. And it has two baseball fields. It has a hockey. And it has a, a rollerblade hockey um, <clears throat> field, actually. It's, and they have two, um, they have basketball courts galore. They have tennis courts. And yeah, they do have the roller roller hockey rink when that when that's that is uh, that is nice that is that is pretty new and the two ball fields one is of course larger than the other so um, they also have several pavilions including a a couple indoor pavilions with basically it's called a lodge then the pool area also has its own pavilion I will show you that and so the pool was again the pool was remodeled a few years ago it was not remodeled actually rebuilt they, they completely rebuilt the pool they took out the old pool we put a new pool in and now the pool has uh, two different water slides two different types of water slides right next to each other um and as far as for me, historically, this is where this is where I had my high school graduation party. This is where my sister had her high school graduation party. This is where um, we've had um, many family reunions for from my dad's side, um, and so of course we've also had. I've also, growing up, played on the. Uh, on the swings and all, and all of that so a lot of memories and if you the if you ever um it's it's a nice park it's a nice nice hometown park um he, they're actually when they do have organized sporting events at the at the fields they do have a concession area there as well that is that that is the concession area for the field and so I'm actually working my way around and I'm passing the pool from the lower end of the park you can see the water slides and on my way up to the top And the the the, um, the park also has woods all behind it as well, as, as you can may have been able to see. And the woods used to have paths you could walk. I could walk down to what's called Old Scrubgrass Road, and then walk over to Scrubgrass Road at the bottom of the hill. And well, basically, I'd 
one of my best friends. I would meet, I, I would meet him when he, he, he back when we were when we were kids. And he'd have a paper out. I'd meet him on his paper out. Then we'd go back and play computer games, games on his computer. So, you know, that's um, I believe the paths now are gone, and they actually did redid the uh, the road for old Strubgrass Road. So now, in order to get down to the road. You'd actually have to go across a uh, a creek, <laughs> so it is not that the, the paths are gone, and so you can't really do that anymore. Um, here's another view of the pool. It appears to be closed, so here's a I can actually show it off, and there's a maintenance building for the pool, and. Walking up, going to the upper part now. <clears throat> also, some good exercise. There is a road that goes around the two ball fields, and I used to do. I used to jog laps around those roads. I got one point was up to 15 laps. So that that is something I may be revisiting. <laughs> but right now, the walk is doing. Is doing good. Is is good, <laughs> and I'm working my way around the um, <clears throat> the park. Has the pool again was remodeled in about four years ago. It originally opened back in the 70s. I believe 73, or or it may have been even before that. It, it's been around for quite quite a while. And now I'm coming up to the upper part. And here is the upper part of the park. And you can see the, um, the picnic areas. And uh, all of the, it's a pretty big park too. There's plenty of, plenty of space. And so here's a better picture. Take a look, and other than that, um, that sums it up. I'll be coming up onto the upper parts. Um, they, have, they do have basketball courts, and they do have a hockey net on the uh, upper part. And I'll be coming around to that. And you can see over there is a that's the indoor lodge. And that is basically that is indoors, so it does have electricity. It has actually all of these picnic areas have do have electricity. Here is a good picture. Here is a good where this is the pool area and the pools. Um, where you go into the pool right here, over to the right, they have a meeting room, party room over to the left and they do have um, they, they also have voting in that room here at the park too and so we'll be going to be coming up to yeah, I'm going to head go, go from a distance and show you where the basketball courts are up on top and of course there's also a play area up here as well as well as one that is down on the opposite on the opposite end see that's the main play area if you look across that is the other that is where the actual other play area is by the, where the tennis courts are and that will sum it up um, it's definitely a nice park to visit I would definitely recommend it if you're ever in the area and as far as entertainment goes there are, are a lot of options here and just walking around is it's that's free and so I don't know if I said it in my video or not that was on my own um, my if I made made my own park not everything at the park would cost money there would be some things there that would be free and so like like things you would find at a regular park 
and so that'll do it um, please if you like the video please like the video and please subscribe to my channel again Pollock's World of Entertainment and you'll get consistent updates and other than that thanks very much everybody have a wonderful day and take care